my god stuff. What's up guys, today we're gonna to be doing Serpent Shrine Cavern. Which is a instance that is it's a raid that's it's one of the other raids from the Burning Crusade expansion. Yes, I got that right. Alright. So this is what it this is a look this So in, it's really in variants. It's hard to tell how many bosses there are exactly, but I'll help you guys out with that by looking in the book here. Two, three, five. Yeah, six bosses in this one instant. This is an elevator boss, by the way. I'm just gonna. By the way, this elevator will kill you if you stand down on it. So I'm just gonna. Oh, yeah. I can actually die to this elevator, so I have to be careful. Now you, want, now you may be wondering, how can you die to an elevator? Well, for for, for some weird reason, when you are underneath this elevator, it will actually kill you. And to me, that doesn't necessarily sound like a good thing. Because it actually isn't. These guys are underbug colossuses. This is the raid version of the other bugs things that I've seen before. So I hate screamers, and that's the beast tamer. These guys have give these guys here give random effects. One just loud sound warning for you guys. Even though I just. Didn't kill them all at once. These guys are purified and tainted water elementals. I'll take these guys down so it's you know what it's like to take each of the types out. Right. This guy is called Hyd. That sounds like a sheet, so Hydros the Unstable. It's the Duke of Crooks. Yep, this one's female. Okay. So. Where's the bot? Where's Hydro? Where the heck is Hydros? Did Miss Hydros die? I'm like, no. By the way, these are the water currents that the th elemental was controlling. And they go haywire without the elemental controlling them. And the elemental, once again, is a she. This is a pretty big ins- this is actually quite a big instance. Alright, here we go. Come on, baby. We can do this. Yes. Come on, 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 come on. Alright, those are the last ones. Now we can go down to Mr. Whoever's area here. Oh, oh, this does a lot of damage. Wow. Wow, 750 damage each time. By the way, I just noticed that all these, these are like r razor fish here. And after killing the elemental, they're like all dead here. Oh, it's staying in this area. All right. To have to get to be able to fight the second boss here, 
you have to fish it up, literally. You literally have to fish up the boss at this exact little hole right here. This will lure out the boss and you can kill it. The name of this one is, if this boss decides to come out, to come out to play. If this boss decides to come out and play, it, I can tell you its name. Well, it is known as... Well, if, if he comes out this time, I don't know if he will. So time to take your... Ooh, man, I'm starting to see some bubbles. Okay, I think he's about to... Ooh, he's about to come out. All right. Yup, there he is. Okay, let's stop him before he does too much destruction. And where is this guy's hitbox? In the water. Okay, this is just great. I want you guys to be able to see him, but yet his hitbox. Yep, this is the guy. The lurker below is the second boss of the instance. And it's also a secret boss. And by the way, why the wa by the way, the reason why the water was damaging me earlier was because he he was still alive. But without him alive, the water doesn't hurt anymore. You could freely swim in this water as much as you like now. Without I mean, the only worry at that point is just losing oxygen. In the water. I think the only other way now is over here. So yeah, the the la other bosses are over here. The other three bosses are in this section. So I think this one's gonna emit like a gas cloud. Oh no, it's gonna emit some frost spores. I guess they emit like random effects each time. These are different types of herbs here. I will show you all really quick. This one is a Tycho. Okay, yeah, these are interesting ones. Fathom Witch. Uh, There's some demon hunter boss guy in here. Wow, this guy instantly casts spells. Holy crap. Okay, I'm just gonna use an insta hit thing on him. I was a. They could cast from far away. Look out of the way so I could. No man, no mana wasted that time. I'm just going to do a little trick here. Just, I'm gonna... To be able to defeat this guy, you have to take out these spell... Binders, yeah. This guy's uh is low thrust the blind this guy is Leo Thrust the Blind. Like Oh I'll never be I'll be back. It's like ah, uh, after you defeat him. Man, it was, he's very dramatic. Wow, he's quite a dramatic dude. Damn, I thought I was dramatic like a time since yes I can be. That sometimes, I only do it to be funny. All right, I, that's the only reason why I do that. I only reason why I'm dramatic. It's just to be funny. That's it. I'm li that's literally. I'm not joking. Oh, now we got crap ton of these guys. So I have a random chance for each. Of this one is nature vulnerability. This one's gonna probably do do a toxic. Nope, nothing. Fire vulnerability. What is this one gonna do? 
house or nothing. Oh, I don't want to loot that by accident. These guys are all named ones. I don't want to kill any more bogs that are nearby. If you speak to this guy, I am free, but the secret is now in peril. A comma must be warned. That was quite loud. Oh god, another five. Alright. Alright, we're gonna take the ball. Oh. I'm just gonna. He doesn't even notice me coming, so I'm just gonna. Oh, he's got a massive hitbox. Might as well just lure all these warlocks here. They just noticed I killed their master. Bro, they, they, they somehow noticed that I killed their master. Alright. Master's Lily, a flippin' giant. Alright. I know I... I know the intended w way was to come out, was to start from there and then go out there. But I, I showed you guys what it's like to do the opposite of that. Well, that's not the last boss of the instance. That was the, actually the second the last boss of the instance. Since I got all these guys out of the way from earlier, I did that so I could be able to show you guys the next part of this easily. If you click on this, this little process build building process will happen. It literally, literally just emerged a bridge from underwater. This bridge leads to. Well, that's the. I, who's saying that is the final. Is who? We are the high And the time has come at last for us to retake our right place in the world. And surprisingly, the, the final boss of this instance is Lady Vash herself. And she's the matron of the Coil Fang. She has a high position similar to how Kelthos and Illidan were in their respective instances. This is what she says if you defeat her. Lord Illidan, I, I am Oh, 
Alright guys, this is the end of the video, so thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure to make sure to for real positively like, comment, and subscribe. Tap the notification bell, share the notification bell, share this with others, and I'll see y'all in the next video. Bye Zs.